Hey learners, Jared here, and we have a very impromptu video lesson for today, and it has to do with jumping out of a swing. Now Jude and I, we conducted two experiments. I leap out of the swing with this rock, right? And then the next jump, I jump out with what color cup? Uh -huh. What color is it? Orange. Orange. And so watch what happens between the two jumps. So in both jumps, I let go of the object so that it has zero initial velocity. But you can see in both videos that when I let it go, it's still moving. But it's only moving relative to the observer. And the observer in this case was the phone. But to me, from my perspective, when I let go of the rock or the cup, they were both initially not moving. Now here's the question. How come the rock didn't hit me in the face, but the cup did? So if we had done this experiment on the moon, besides suffocating to death, <laughs> neither object would have hit me in the face because there wouldn't be any air resistance. I'd let go of both and they would just stay the same distance in front of me because there wouldn't be any external force pushing the object the other way. Conducting this experiment on the moon shows that the mass of the object doesn't change how it travels as long as there is no air resistance. Apollo 15 did this with a hammer and an eagle feather drop in the vacuum. And you can see that both objects fall at the exact same rate. Now, let's take a look at these position graphs with respect to time. Both the rock and I have curvature in our Y position graph which denotes that we are accelerating in the y direction. We're falling, but our x position graph is linear, which means we have zero acceleration. The cup, however, has curvature in its x position graph. At the moment I release it, it starts traveling back to me because it is accelerating in both the y and the x dimension. You are accelerating if you have curvature in your position graph. Here we go. Thanks for watching, and as always, this is away. Hey, as always, as always, keep learning. Keep learning. Nailed it. Let's say, as always, as always, keep learning. Keep learning.